The problem is that coral reefs are the most environmentally stressed ecosystems in the world. They're also the most biodiverse ecosystems in the world. They are the true canaries in the coal mine with respect to climate change. Problems Without Passport is a college-created program. It's essentially where students have the opportunity to do a hands-on experience. It's a four-unit course that you can take over the summer, and they're all about taking what you learn in the classroom, going abroad for a couple weeks, and applying that knowledge to the field and learning more about international problems and maybe what you could do in the future to solve them. This was tied to the Environmental Studies program by a program through Guam and Palau where we did underwater scuba diving research, studied biodiversity, and looked at some of the environmental patterns, laws, processes that are included in both of those countries. We have a dive training facility uh, out on Catalina Island as part of the uh, Wrigley Marine Science Center. So we have a lot of things to do in this part of the Catalina trip. We know that you guys haven't been diving in a little bit, so you know it's going to be a refresher dive. It's basically going to be refreshing those skills. We'll you know swim around, just get used to the water. Uh, since most of the students had never made a dive, we had to run them through a good bit of the curriculum during spring semester, and that meant on four weekends uh, they were all out on Catalina swimming doing basic dive instruction, doing academic classroom components associated with diving. I think a course like this is really unique in that we can, we can go beyond the classroom and study things above and below the water, but really get a hands-on experience. We were very well prepared because we've spent so many weekends in Catalina learning how to do this. But when you actually jump off the boat at Palau, we were in the ecosystem seeing relatively untouched marine environments. Underwater, what we were typically doing was laying transect tapes, so 100 meter transect tapes, and at every 20 meters we were marking how many indicator species we saw. Indicator species are species of fish and invertebrates that essentially indicate that the coral is healthy and thriving. Being able to see these things firsthand, for example, looking at the effects of global climate change, is something that you can talk about in a class, but actually seeing how a very small change in temperature might affect ocean chemistry and seeing how that change in ocean chemistry may affect corals, for example, and then take this and extrapolate this to the whole world. On our off days, we had meetings with policy advisors, got to meet with people who are involved in the Guam government. We got to form our own opinions about how bureaucracy affects science. I feel like I've learned a lot more about how to give an interdisciplinary view to these sorts of issues. So it's kind of the science side versus the policy side versus the economic side versus the humanities side. We saw every aspect of that. Guam is a U.S. territory and during World War II was considered the military hub of the Pacific Ocean. So it was really unique to see, you know, these old war relics underwater that had become home to a brand new ecosystem. My favorite dive slash experience was when we got to go in Palau to the rock islands and see the jellyfish in the marine lakes. One species of jellyfish had developed photosynthetic properties, so basically you can go into these lakes and snorkel around, swim with these jellyfish, and they don't sting you. And there are thousands and thousands of these jellyfish of all different sizes. They move throughout the day to different locations within these lakes depending on the sun because they follow the sun and gain their energy that way. This is not the sort of thing that you're ever going to see in a million years at a for-profit university. YSC, SC has the facilities. The college is an innovator in experiential learning. These are marquee experiences. This is so far beyond chalk and erasers and overhead. This is a true game changer. I can't recommend this trip enough. You should sign up for it ASAP. Travel is so valuable. There's nothing that really substitutes for what your eyes can see.